What's going on guys, Healy here, and today I'm going to be going over all the legends in MLB The Show 18. So, if you guys don't know already, there are three new legend teams in MLB The Show 18. In the past few years, I would say, there haven't been any legend teams, there's just been legends in the game. I'm pretty sure around 2009, 2010, there was. But in this year's game, there are the Long Ball Beasts. Expansion era boomers and the mid century groundbreakers. Each has a different time period, all grouped together in one. The mid century groundbreakers are from, I believe, maybe the 50s and before that. Then you got the expansion era boomers, maybe the 60s through the 80s. And then you got the long ball beasts, which are from like the 90s until now for the people that are retired and in the game. There's a couple of people in this game that have retired in the past few years. But we will go over the legends. You can play as these teams in play now. You could also use them in the practice mode as well if you want to get your swing down with some of the legends before maybe buying them in Diamond Dynasty. So going from the play section in MLB The Show 18, you could go to the options, go to roster control. Uh, you go to player movement, and then if you go over L1, you can go to the legend teams. The long ball beast, like I said, has all the people from like the 90s to the 2000s. So you got Oral Hershizer, Brett Saberhagen, Roy Oswald, Jack McDowell, Doug Drayback, Dennis Eckersley, Eric Gagne, Billy Wagner, all guys from previous the past few years. But you also have Troy Percival, who is new, Dave Steeb. Tony Gwynn, Cal Ripken Jr., Ken Griffey Jr., Chipper Jones, Frank Thomas, Jeff Bagwell, Piazza. Piazza's new. Also, Frank Thomas is new as well. You got Luis Gonzalez, Roberto Alomar, Jorge Posada, Paul Conurco, Barry Larkin, Vlad Guerrero, who is new. Same with ben Benito Santiago. You got Jason Giambi, Eric Haros. Fred McGriff, Omar Vizquel, Cliff Floyd, Johnny Damon, Jim Edmonds, Steve Finley, Kenny Lofton, Dante Bichette, Sean Green, and Edgar Martinez for the long ball beast. Before we get any further, I just want to let you guys know these are not ratings for Diamond Dynasty. I think they take like all the years combined and put like, I don't know necessarily their best years or how they do ratings for these legend teams, but these are not what the ratings are going to be for diamond IC and in diamond IC they're going to have multiple cards moving on to the expansion era boomers you have nolan ryan tom siever vito blue bill niacro don sudden which is a new addition to the game bruce sutter goose gossage you got lee smith who is new as well ron gidry jack morris mike scott burt blylevin ryan sandberg robin yount Reggie Jackson, Mike Schmidt, Andre Dawson, George Brett, Eddie Murray, Jim Rice, Gary Carter, Carlton Fisk, Wade Boggs, Ozzie Smith, Dave Winfield, Will Clark, Steve Garvey, Keith Hernandez, who is new to the game. You got Harold Reynolds, Buddy Bell, Paul Molitor, Mario Mendoza, Albert Bell, another one. There's about 20 to 30 new additions in this game. You got Joe Carter, Harold Baines, who is new to MLB The Show, Ken Griffey Sr., you got Dale Murphy, and that's it for the expansion era boomers. And then the final team, you got the mid-century groundbreakers. This is the oldest team, the guys that played way back in the day. You have Bob Gibson, who is an absolute beast, new to the game. Bob Feller, Warren Spawn, Louis Tiant, Louis Tiant, Hiller Perry, Raleigh Fingers, Catfish Hunter, Fergie Jenkins, Juan Marichal, Jim Palmer, Doc Ellis, who is new. If you guys don't know his historic no-hitter, I would look it up. It's definitely intriguing and awesome to read about, listen about. Jackie Robinson, Ernie Banks, Babe Ruth, who is new. The big addition, probably the best addition you could add to a MLB The Show game. The Babe, Great Bambino. Teddy Ball Game, Harmon Killebrew, Johnny Bench, Al Kaline, Eddie Matthews, 
Richie Ashburn. He is a new to 18. Yogi Berra, Willie McCovey, Joe Morgan, Billy Williams, the Cubby. He is finally in MLB The Show. You have Orlando Cepeda, Tony Perez, Willie Stargell, Rod Carew, Bill Mazeroski, another new guy. Uh, the mid-century groundbreakers have a lot of new guys added to MLB The Show. Brooks Robinson, Joe Torrey, there's another one. Luis Aparicio, Pee Wee Reese, another one. Lou Brock, Ralph Kiner, Larry Doby, yet another new guy. And then Eno Slaughter. With a long ball beast, Trevor Hoffman is in the game. Same with Lenny Dykstra. They aren't on the legend teams. I'm unsure if they're going to be added to the legend teams in the future, but they are available in Diamond Dynasty. Also, in practice mode, you are unable to hit with legends that aren't in the starting lineups. So if you want to use any of these guys in practice mode, like Vladimir Guerrero or Frank Thomas, who are not in the starting lineup, you are going to have to take them from one of these teams and then put them on. We'll just go with the Red Sox. You could swap them over. And then uh, we will go to Vlad, swap him over for Mookie Betts. You're going to have to save the changes, auto-fix the rosters, and then once you go to custom practice, we will go to the AL East. And then they should pop up. Frank Thomas is right there. You'll be able to use him in the practice mode. Unfortunately, you have to use a workaround to use him in practice mode, but... There is a simple fix. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like, subscribe down below. Let me know your favorite legend in MLB The Show 18. This is Healy, and I'm out. Peace.